news of the battle that India has forgotten. Out of 124 personnel on this company, 114 were martyred. It's unprecedented, unparalleled example of the greatest sacrifice by Indian soldiers. On 18th November 1962, the 124 soldiers of C Company, 13th Kumau. Holding the Rezang La Pass at a height of 18,000 feet, came under heavy Chinese attack. Ill-equipped and heavily outnumbered. Dushman ka to supermedium ka gun. Hamare pa tank bhi nahi hai. Us time pa hamare pa three note three rifle thi. Wo sab bhi muskil se bogo load hua karte the. They beat back the enemy several times. Apni Bharat Mata ki jameen ke liye asli sunne kurban ho jayega. Lekin marne se pehle dus ya pandra ko marega, tab wo sahi ho jayega. Major Shatan Singh led by example, motivating his men to fight even after being badly shot in the arms and abdomen. जब डेथ बॉडी हमारी लाये फरवरी में, तब वहाँ पर देखा गया कि सबके आगे से सीने में, हाथों में या मुंह पर या किसी के हेलमेटों में इतने इतने छेद हो गए, कोई ऐसा आदमी नहीं था 114 में C Company fought to the last man. Basat ke ek choda, jo veer ahi sahid hoye desh, kisne kya diya aaj tak? Bahut dard hota hai. Sipai jab border pe khada hota hai, ye sochta hai ki ye Bharat waachiyo aaram se soye mein khada hoon border ke upar. Lekin jab wo lardta lardta jawan sahid ho jata hai. तो भारतवासी का हर फर्ज है कि उस जवान के बच्चों को देखे, लेकिन ये रजांगला के शहीदों को आज तक नहीं देखा, नहीं देखा, नहीं देखा। In our country, we haven't really appreciated the work of the armed forces. This that should be recognised in the proper manner. In my opinion, it has not happened. Just ten men out of a full strength of 124 survived the carnage at Rezangla. Ladies and gentlemen, 50 years after the Sino-Indian War, the heroes of Rezangla are this year's winners of the CNN IBM Lifetime Achievement Award. If Ladakh is still part of this country, it is because of the bravery they showed. The film Hakikat was based on their life.